I'm here to talk to you about the Technician Commitment, which I've proudly signed us up to. Why? Because we're lucky enough to have a large number of technicians working with us here at the Wellcome Sanger Institute. That's a group of exceptional professionals who've been unsung heroes for too long, and that's why I've pledged to make the Technician's Commitment a reality here at Sanger, to help us recognise, develop and sustain our technicians' careers, because without them, this institute's world-leading research simply would not happen. So what is the Technician Commitment? And what does signing up mean for our community? The Technician's Commitment is pledging to, to tackle a number of issues. These involve clarity on career paths, support for development and learning, as well as ensuring key recognition for, for the role that people are playing. So I think it's really great that the Institute is recognising all of its many, many technicians by signing up to the commitment. There's been an absolute focus on our technicians. There's been a steering group that's set up, a number of working groups as well, and, and these, these activities have, have led towards the development of an action plan too. The action plan has been designed by technicians for technicians. So technical services across campus can mean a lot of, a lot of different variety of different things and a lot of variety of different skill sets. So it might be somebody that deals with a lot of our um, chemical waste, for example. It might be somebody that knows something specialist knowledge about how to use a piece of our equipment. But that may also be people that support our laboratories, so such as our computer scientists and bioinformaticians. And they really have very specific technical skills that really boost and support the research that we're doing in our um, laboratories. As a technician, my day-to-day -day role can include ordering consumables for the lab, so pipette tips and flasks and things that people need for their experiments. I also help people run whatever experiments they want me to do, so most of the time I work with the head of electron microscopy in, in the Parasites and Microbes programme, and we do microscopy for other people who want to see what their samples look like. We're rolling out our Technician Commitment pledges to technicians working in every department of our busy institute to celebrate and support their contributions across the board. We provide support for the researchers, but we rely on, on the IT support group which provides infrastructure for us and the hardware to run the tools and pipelines for the researchers. I work predominantly in the data centre and the surrounding networking areas, the comms rooms. So it's mainly maintenance and monitoring, so that can be anything from calling to the actual physical hardware, so if hard drives break down, any problems have to be fixed. I'm a technician myself by background, and so I've seen firsthand how crucial it is that the technical community are given increased visibility, recognition, opportunity to develop their careers, but also that technical skills themselves are sustained within our organisations. We're proud to be supported by the Science Council in bringing our technician commitment to life and in growing the next generation of early career technicians here at the Institute. Our Technician Commitment pledges will be an ongoing rollout of activities, events and development opportunities that will become integrated into the Institute's way of working. We are committed to developing a technician portal for technicians pursuing their careers at Sanger, along with a programme of regular events and conferences for professionals and career development. We'll also be encouraging and supporting our technicians to become members of professional bodies. We're backing our technicians to take their careers to the next level. So when it comes to the technician commitment... I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in.